this is a dangerous vehicle. This vehicle is a complete this death is trap. This is not a vehicle. This is a giant golf cart. Oh, hey guys, it's Jay Lisi. Welcome back to my channel. It's that special time of year where Josh and I head up to Gibtown Bike Fest, which is honestly one of my favorite bike fests. Even though it's pretty small, everybody is having such a good time. I mean, last year we rode with Thick Lizzie in a helicopter. It was great. So turns out wearing platform boots on tall bikes is great. I should have listened to you all a long time ago. I'll admit. Ah, uh, yay, we're a pack now. Oh, but these guys don't wear gear. Bad baby. Oh no! Oh, we're right by the big mountain. I always forget that that exists. It's the only mountain Florida has is our big sulfur mountain. Best part about Gibtown Bike Fest is that it is not far from my house. I've never been to Daytona Bike Fest, but this one is very Florida. I think I'm smoking cigarettes while riding. Bad babies. These guys are for real tough. I'm just baby tough. Josh says he's been to Gibtown Bike Fest 11 years in a row. That's longer than I've been even riding motorcycles. Oh my God, they're all on Hondas. You meet the worst people on a Honda, it's true. At least these two guys in the back are on Hondas. Yeah, I've never cleaned the PC800, but it looks like it needs it. The only time I ever clean the bike is when I'm about to put a sticker on it. I only clean the spot I'm about to put a sticker on. I don't want to jinx myself, but I'm just saying, I haven't dropped the PC800 since I took that trip to the Blue Ridge, and maybe it's just luck, but I think I'm getting better at riding. Oh good, they have a prayer station over there so you can forget your sins before or after you go in. Oh God. Going slow on the grass is Shay Lisi's worst nightmare on this bike. Guys, you cannot park your bike here. Guys, you cannot park your bike here. Please park what we tell you to park. Park your bike. All right, park it. Go. I'm not trying to drop my bike by doing all those crazy maneuvers. I think that's absolutely fine. Sorry, I'm a little close to you. Which H3H3 is here? Take the picture right back here. Come on over. Take the picture of the Oh my god, I love this motorcycle. When Hot told me a 300 would suit me better, I hope this is what they meant. Look at the dragon. All right, and away we go. Goodbye to Gibtown Bike Fest. It's fun as always. Even though I didn't eat any greasy fair food this year, it's probably for the best. You know, even though Josh has to work tonight, I know it was hard for him to come out to Gibtown first thing in the morning after working until four in the morning last night and having to go straight back into work. But it was worth it. Give Town is always so fun. Ain't no rest for the wicked, right? It is perfect weather out here. 70 degrees, not a cloud in the sky. How could you say no to going out riding today? This is the next day and we are here at the Forgotten Angels property. We took the Ford Ranger out instead of riding our motorcycles because it is the one of seven days in Florida when it actually gets cold. So we came out here to trade vehicles so we could take home this, what year is it? 91 Jeep Wrangler, baby. 
1991 Jeep Wrangler and do a little bit of base work on it. It runs and rides, but it just needs like a little bit of a carb change. It's a stick shift and it looks, um, Looks like someone's Good. gonna be taking it home. Um, so we're going to be hosting a short raffle that is one week long. So if you buy a ticket during the week, then you have the possibility to win this Jeep Wrangler. So I don't really blame you if you wait till next week to buy a raffle ticket because that is not something I would want to take home with me. <laughs> but you might. So buy a raffle ticket this week and this could be yours for only $25. Now let's see if you can still drive stick. All right, Shay Lisi, start us up. Well, don't forget to put the clutch in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you gotta push the clutch in. <laughs> and yeah, there's no clutch safety switch on this. It's like, why do I have to put the clutch in? Uh oh, try again. Try to. You can do it. Make sure it's in first too, which is all the way all the way over and up. There you go. Okay. All right. Give now slowly let out the clutch while also giving it a little bit of gas. What do you mean you don't remember how to drive stick? Look at her go immediately. All right. Now hopefully I don't flip us. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Actually, be careful because that is a that is a worry. These things flip. This, this is a dangerous vehicle. This vehicle is a complete this death trap. This is not a vehicle. This is a giant golf cart. <laughs> That's what we love about them. Look at you go. Here, try shifting in a second. Which is down, right? Yeah, so down, down one. That's neutral. So well, let's go back in first and get started again. So you go back in first. Push, you got well, your clutch all the way in. First, all right. Now same thing. Look, do you doing it? You know how to do this. All right. So to shift in a second, you're gonna depress the clutch and pull it all the way back. I'm already depressed. <laughs> you might have put it into fourth instead of instead of second, which is next to second. And if you need to put it back into first, go there. You go. That's second. <laughs> Look at you, you're trundling around. You feel, is it a Jeep girl thing? I wouldn't understand. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Does this, doesn't this feel dangerous? This ain't my boyfriend's car. <laughs> yeah, this is terrifying. <laughs> I felt safer driving the uh, motorcycle that had the sidecar, the, what is it called, the Ural? Yeah, than the Jeep. Yeah, the Ural seems safer at the Jeep at this point. I, I, you know, I felt, I feel safer in the Ural too. I'm not gonna lie to you right now. <laughs> <laughs> not too much speed. So, uh, she, at least he does remember how to drive stick. By the way, as we bounce around in the Jeep over here, <laughs> uh, I don't know if I feel safe or not, but she remembers. So that's first. So then this would be neutral. Okay. Then that's first. Do I need to do anything else right now? No, just leave it. Turn the key off. I gotta say, I don't see the appeal of this vehicle, but that doesn't mean other people don't. But I guess it's just a Jeep girl thing. I don't understand it. <laughs> Flashback. I am here with the Ford Tremor, and I guess Josh is in it too. We are headed up to Burt's Black Widow in Port Charlotte to pick up the raffle motorcycle. It's year two, so that means this year's raffle's gotta be twice as good. So we decided to up the prize and give away two things. All right, Gunner's taking us back here to be murdered. It's the Dexter Lab. <laughs> Season nine coming out, you see that? What the hell, they have you working back here? Yes. This is your With all the spiders? I'm like a black widow. <laughs> What's going on here? <laughs> they're, they're definitely fuzzy, yeah, yeah. Some of them have, dusty. Some some of them them have babies, so yeah, we just... Uh... Babies as in actual spiders? Yeah, I believe yeah. so, probably. <laughs> I wouldn't help that either, yeah. There's definitely a lot happening, so. Yeah, this is where they keep us. Oh, he's so sweet. Hello, I just met you, but I love you. So Bert's Black Widow actually
actually has a really amazing selection of riding shoes. They, I'm definitely gonna be buying some next time that I come here because they actually have a heel that will make it so I can ride more motorcycles. I know everybody's been telling me to get platform boots and I hear you, they're expensive, but I've been saving up. Thanks, Patreon. All right, bye party people. We pull a crowd everywhere we go. And a flashback. Thank you so much for tuning into this week's episode. Starting today, Sunday, the 23rd, you have the chance to win that 1991 Jeep Wrangler. And if you don't want it, we can just sell it and you can get the money because I know I don't want it. Uh, it's definitely a acquired taste and if you are a jeep person then this is definitely your vehicle you have one week starting today and we're gonna pull the raffle on monday the 31st on josh's live stream so we'll see you there i'm here for you every sunday and wednesday make sure you like comment subscribe hit the ding dong diddle and do all the things i will see you here on wednesday bye <laughs>